Recently, some countries are accusing China of producing new energy vehicles or NEVs. What is the real situation? I'm right now on the Chang'an Avenue in Beijing, the capital city of China. And if you would look at all the vehicles running on the streets, every car with a green car plate would be an NEV. How many of those do we have in Beijing? How many of those in China? Does it really mean that China is having a overcapacity of NEV production? We're going to have a discussion of that today. Okay. First, to discuss whether Chinese NEV production is suffering overcapacity, we need to know first why would we produce and use NEVs or new energy vehicles? We know that energy sector would underpin economic activity. And for China, who's pointing out that by the year 2030 it would reach carbon peak and by 2060 carbon neutrality, apparently reducing the use. And need a fossil fuel instead. Improving and developing the new energy sector is a necessity. So, how many NEVs do China have? Well, by the end of June of 2024, China had a total of 340 million cars. Among them, only 20 million were NEVs or new energy vehicles. And when it comes to export, only 12 percent of those NEVs produced in China. Have been exported to other countries. The rest have all remained in China. And the interesting figures I would show you next. In contrast to the 12 percent of NEVs export from China, 80 percent of the microchips produced in the United States are exported. 80 percent of the automobiles produced in Germany, 50 percent of the automobiles produced in Japan are exported to other countries. Another very intriguing set of figures says that the number two brand of NEVs sales in China, guess what? It's Tesla. Of course, Tesla is doing very well in the United States as well. It's selling 55 percent of all the NEVs in the United States. And when it comes to NEV sales in the United States, the number one Chinese brand would be Geely, who sold about. 0.4 percent of all the NEVs in the American market, and it's now ranking 13th on the list. That's the only Chinese enterprise that's in the top 13. So you can see the contrast. So what's in the future for new energy vehicles? Well, one thing is for sure: that China will further encourage the production and use of NEVs. The over dozens of Chinese producers are planning to put 71 new NEV models on sale this year alone. Many of them will be bigger, more spacious, better looking, and have better performances, so that they will be more appealing to Chinese customers and will be more competitive overseas. So, what's really going to happen in the future? I guess we'll have to wait and see.